hey guys welcome to the next video of c programming language tutorial for beginners so in the last video we have seen how to compare two strings using strcmp function in a c programming now in this video we are going to see how to use strchr function in a c programming so strchr function is basically used to find a particular character in a given string now let's see how to use this now before writing program using this function we will get some theoretical part of this function now here suppose if we have string called as a learn programming like this and if you want to search for character r in a in this string now in this situation we can use this strchr function so for this strchr function we have to write strchr and in the brackets we have to pass string for example learn programming like this or any other string like this and by giving comma we have to pass a character that we want to search in a given string now the one important thing that we have to remember is that it will return pointer to the first occurrence of character in a given string now for example if we have this string called as a learn programming and if you want to pass the or if you want to search the character r now in this situation it will find first occurrence of r in this string so first occurrence of r is here now this will return whole string from this r to the end of the string so this is how the strchr function works in a c programming now let's see how to use this in the code so here we need to define one string so let's take here one string so we have to use character array here so use char i am giving name str1 and here we have to give two brackets and here by giving equals to sign we have to assign one string to this character array so here i am giving value so here i have one string called as a str1 and this str1 contains string learn programming yourself which is my channel name now if we want to search particular character then we have to use one character here also so just declare one character i am giving name ex like this and here i am passing value say p like this now here i i want to search for character p in this given string now we have seen that it returns pointer to the first occurrence of character now we need one pointer to store the result so let's use character pointer we have to use this star and here i am giving name result to the pointer like this now after that we have to use these functions so to use this function we have to write result which is our pointer here so write your pointer name result is equals to strchr and in the brackets we have to pass our string so let's pass str1 which is our string so let's pass here str1 and after giving comma we have to pass the character that we want to search now here we have to pass ex like this now after execution of this statement our result variable or our result pointer will contain pointer to the first occurrence of this character called as a p now let's print the value of this result by using printf statement so they use printf inside the brackets we have to pass percent %s and after that we have to give a reference of result like this now our code is ready so let's build and run the code to see the output here Now here as you can see the output is programming your cell. 
now here it is finding character p so p is here and it returns or it prints the whole string from p to end of the string now let's change the value of this ex so make it here o like this and again build and run the code to see the output so here as you can see the output is this string so here it will find the character o from the string and it will return the whole string or it will print the whole remaining string from this main string so in this way we can use strchr function in a c programming so strchr function is basically used to find a particular character in a given string so remember that it always returns pointer to the first occurrence of the character now in this video we learn how to use strchr function in a c programming and in the next video we will see the next part